Hi, this is Robin. I want to welcome all my friends that's been with me from the beginning and my friends that are new. Um, this is just going to be a short video. I was at Walmart with my husband getting my medicine and my phone rang and it was my sister. And um, my mom and most of my family lives three hours away from me. Uh, she told me that my brother Bob was taken to the hospital and they found out that he has blood clots in his lungs and they're going to admit him in the ICU. Um, they're given a medication uh, to dissolve the blood clots and hoping that his body will absorb the extra blood. But my mom is going to be 90 years old and this is really hard and it's hard being away from the family, even though it's three hours. Um, I'm not originally supposed to be even in the car driving for long periods because the doctor's afraid that I'm going to get thrown or banged up. So um, I just want to ask you if you would please pray for my brother Bob. Uh, keep him in your prayers and your thoughts. And um, just pray that uh, this will resolve and... Um, what they're doing is going to help him to get better and uh just you know pray for my mom that she will have the strength to uh deal with everything that's going on with him and um like again his his name's bob and uh i'd really really appreciate it and my other brother darwin that lives in south carolina a while back uh Liz from Thrifty 50 had him on the prayer request because um, he had neck surgery. And here, a week ago, he got an infection back in his neck and they had to readmit him to the hospital in South Carolina and they had to open him up and clear out all the infection. And um, they had to test the infection before they could even give him an antibiotic to find out what kind it was. So... Then they had a catheter in him, and then he couldn't, you know, he couldn't go to the bathroom. So here the catheter caused an infection in his bladder. So now they sent him home with a, um, what I just said it was called, my mind's just not here today. They sent him home with that thing in him that, the catheter for 10 days, and then he has to go back. And they'll take it out and they'll see if his bladder is uh, working properly then. So I don't know. It's just a bunch of stuff going on. It's like if it's one thing, if it ain't one thing, it's another. And with him living nine hours from my mom, it's just she just don't know what to do with herself. So God is good. He answers prayer. So please keep both my brother Darwin and my brother Bob in your prayers if you would. And I'd really, really appreciate it. So thank you for listening. And I appreciate every single one of you. Thank you. Take care. Bye.